In this video, I'll be reviewing these Vocalin Hyper Pro headphones. Going to be talking about the features and also my experience with these headphones. So first, these headphones come with the headphones, of course, also comes with a nice hard shell carrying case, which includes a TRS cable, which you can plug into your headphones if you want to do that. And it also comes with a USB-C uh, cord for charging. So this is an up close view of the headphones. You have the logo right here. Um, the ear part is really soft and you can rotate these like this. It doesn't go any further and you could see they also move right here and you can extend this much with these headphones. They also have the left and right um, so you know where to put them and this is how they look on. Not too bulky. They're kind of lightweight and um, feel very soft on the ears. As far as the buttons on these headphones right here, you have your ANC button. Um, so you can switch between the different modes on here. So ANC is active noise canceling. So it will cancel out all the noise and you can hear your music really well. The ANC does a good job. You can turn the ANC off and then it has your be aware mode, which you can hear your environment while you're listening to your music. Right here, you have your mic mute and unmute that you can use during your calls. You have your power button then where you can input the TRS cable and your um, input for the USB-C cable. So let's talk about some of the cool features that you get with these. So the first thing you get up to 60 hours of playtime, so plenty of hours so you don't have to worry about charging these after each use. You have a multi-point connection feature with these. So you can connect these to two devices at the same time and switch between those devices. And my favorite feature with these that I've really been enjoying is the touch control. So on this right earmuff right here, this is the control panel. Um, so you can control different things by just swiping and touching. So you can by tapping, you can play and pause your music. With the swipe, if you swipe, you can change to the next song or you can go back to the previous song. You can also adjust your volume with the touch control. So if you want to increase your volume, you can swipe up. If you want to decrease the volume, you can swipe down. You also have call controls on these with the control panel. So if you double tap, you can answer your call. You can hang up your call with one tap and you can also one tap to reject calls. And the last feature with these headphones and something else I really liked is the app control. So you can go into the app and you can change different things. One thing that I changed and I noticed when I was using the headphones uh, without using the app is the bass wasn't that good with just, you know, using them straight out the box, but you can go in the app and change the EQ and they have custom settings. They do have a bass setting and it really does add some nice bass to your music. Some other settings that I like within the app is you can see the battery life that you have left for your headphones. You also have level controls with your different modes. So for ANC, you can change the level of it. You can do low, medium, high for the ANC off and also for the awareness mode, you can change those levels. You also have touch control customization features in the app. So if you want to change your different touch controls and set them to specific things, you can do that within the app. Overall, I've been really impressed with these headphones. I've been using them a lot for my workouts. I think the sound quality is good and all the customization features are really, really cool. And I've really been enjoying that. So definitely like these headphones right here.